Hey, this is Mike, and today I'd like to talk about GameStop. This stock trades on the NYSE, and the symbol GME. This stock was up over 18.5%, up to 108.73. It did move down a little bit after hours, down to $106. GameStop, probably one of the craziest stocks of probably the past decade. You see it had an incredible run-up where it went as high as uh, almost $400 before moving all the way back down, settling around under $50 level. Then a couple of days ago, really started moving back up again. It did more than double in one day and it continued moving up even in a day when we had uh, an incredible meltdown in the market now at one point GameStop was up uh, probably almost uh, over about 40 or 50 percent for the day before ending pretty much almost at the lows of the day and then it continued moving down so one of the reasons why GameStop was moving up not only a renewed short squeeze but Jim Cramer yesterday uh, sent out uh, a tweet that suggests that GameStop should do a direct offering raise, um, you know, whether I think it was like a billion dollars and then take that billion dollars and buy Bitcoin. And if they did that, their stock would rocket up to $430 in no time. And I think that excited a lot of investors. The, the possibility that GameStop could take advantage of the fact that their stock is now elevated in price and they could raise some money and buy Bitcoin. It actually sounds like a pretty smart move. And I actually think that that there may be some um, truth to maybe what Jim Cramer is saying that this may happen because the CFO of GameStop was recently pushed out by billionaire investor Ryan Cohen, who now owns a 13.3% stake in the company. So it is possible that maybe the CF, CFO was approached with that plan and pushed back on that plan and maybe he was forced out. So there could be something to that. And if GameStop did buy a billion dollars of Bitcoin, especially now that Bitcoin is down in price, that might be an incredible investment opportunity for the company. So I definitely think there's some there's some huge upside potential to GameStop in the short term. Now, I still have some shares of GameStop. I sold off 90% of my shares during the first run-up, but I've held 10% because I still believe that GameStop is going to be a huge e-commerce company. Or maybe not a huge e-commerce company, but a really profitable, uh, growing e-commerce company over the next decade. And my target was when this company had a market value of less than $600 million, I put a $30 billion market cap on the company for the year 2030. And it's more than uh, more than ahead on my projections due to the, you know, the whole Wall Street bets run up. But that being said, I do think GameStop is a good company to buy for the extreme long term. There may be some potential for this stock to make make some big upward moves in the short term if they do indeed buy Bitcoin. But this is definitely a stock that you're going to want to watch and make a good short term speculative play. I think on pullbacks, uh, it might be a good stock to buy if you want to own it on the long term. But if you do want to own the stock on the long term, just be aware that you're going to experience a lot of lot of volatility. I think that the, the extreme interest in this stock is not going to end anytime soon. So go ahead and check out GameStop. Once again, it trades on the NYC and the symbol GME. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to leave a like and go ahead and subscribe and turn on notifications. <clears throat> I do multiple daily updates on stocks, options, and stock train strategies. Thanks a lot. Bye.